back to my channel thank you so much for being here and watching today's video today is another styling basics episode and in today's video I thought I would share and focus on the white t-shirt because of course it's an absolute classic in all of our wardrobes and I know for a fact that I personally just wear on repeat a white tee throughout the seasons and it's one of my like go-to pieces when I'm feeling a bit like what do I put on if I want to do like everyday outfits and casual looks and things like that I think it's just like the capsule wardrobe piece to a T for all seasons as well. So wanted to focus on this this week and share a few different outfits and ways to wear. I've actually this week really kind of focused on the same pieces styled different ways and I've just tried to focus on that mainly in this video because I wear these outfits on repeat and I wear blue jeans on repeat and I wear my black jeans on repeat so I kind of wanted to embed that in this video and share the different ways that I style them within it as well. So first up just the classic blue jeans, white trainers and the white tee. These are my go-to River Island straight leg jeans which you may have heard me talk about already in previous videos but they're just such a nice tapered fit leg and super authentic denim so they're just super comfortable but have that real denim touch to them as well and I've had these for probably a year and they just last all year round and then they just keep bringing them out each season which I just love because it means I can share the love for them with you guys as well. So styling it like this and this is I guess it's like an everyday moving probably from the end of spring into summer when the days get a little bit warmer and we can just be in a t-shirt and we don't have to wear a jacket but for now I've also shared and shown this look styled with my trench coat. My trench coat at the moment is like literally all I go and grab out of my wardrobe. The weather's been so on and off and I never really know what to wear when it starts to get to this point where it is humid but then sometimes it gets a bit cooler when the wind starts to blow and a trench coat is just perfect for that. So styling the white tee with my trench as like my transitional coat that I'm literally wearing on repeat at the moment. I kind of like interchange between my trench, my fake leather jacket and also my black blazer. So within this video you'll see the different ways that I style those pieces as well embedded into like the spring transitional wardrobe but this is just like everyday classic super easy to put on and chuck on and then obviously you can change the jeans to whatever your favorite pair of jeans are for that everyday outfit Next up, styling the shirt that I'm actually currently wearing as well with the white tee and chucking on an extra little layer for the look. So for those days that we can just wear a shirt and a t-shirt, I find that this is a really lovely way to style, again, the blue jeans and the white tee together and the trainers and have it as a more cool option. Obviously, you can then layer on with your favorite trench or transitional coat piece in your wardrobe before we get to those really, really warm summer days. But I do love styling like loads of different colored tees with like a blue shirt or just a shirt over as well it's a really nice way to layer moving into spring but the classic blue and white stripes is just one of my go-to's especially when we're moving into the end of spring into summer I just love a white and blue shirt like this it actually took me a while to find one similar because this is a few years old I've had this for like three years now but I found a really really lovely similar one on H&M that doesn't actually have like the cropped sleeves but I think I'd actually prefer to have one with longer sleeves personally because sometimes I feel like although it's that really Really nice boxy shape but it's quite nice to have like a classic shirt that is that like normal length sleeve and like boxy oversized slouchy fit too but just sharing another everyday classic look that you can wear just out and about going to grab your coffee on your walks when it starts to get warmer and just adding that like extra touch of whether it's a color or just a neutral color shirt to the white tee I feel like it really kind of brings the outfit to life a little bit as well and it's just that like perfect chuck on leave the house and just feel super comfortable comfortable as well. Next up, styling the blue jeans a third way in this video because I do seriously wear these on repeat so this is just literally outfits that I always go and grab and they're just perfect for all seasons and there's just loads of different ways to style them. So moving into spring as well, my black blazer is like one of my go-to pieces that I always just seem to like gravitate towards when I'm styling my outfits, especially in the future when we can go out a little bit more and hopefully do some like brunches and things like that. I just find that the blazer can really like put together an outfit. So styling the white tee and blue jeans here with some black accessories so tying in the black blazer with the black belt and then the chunky black boots as well I love bringing out my black boots and black blazer combo at this time of year because I just love the fact that it's warm enough not having to like chuck on a really chunky coat over the top of a blazer I have had this blazer for a few years so I will link a few similar down below but this is just again like a really easy classic look to chuck on for everyday wear 
wear especially for like bottomless brunches it's also just a nice outfit that kind of feels a little bit in between like everyday looks and also a little bit dressy as well and then obviously you can change out the boots if for like a little point toe boot as well if you wanted to make it a bit more evening wear and then apply like a red lip and tie your hair up as well if you kind of wanted to take it a little bit more into date night too there's just ways that you can easily kind of take this into evening glam looks by just changing out those accessories to elevate the look as well completely forgot that i filmed this outfit but next outfit with the blue jeans again and ribbed vests for moving into spring i have just loved this was a trend last year that just like popped off and i feel like it's coming back in again which i'm so glad about because i have so many in my wardrobe that i'm just loving layering with at the moment and i've just got this classic black ribbed vest here which i will definitely try and find similar for link down below but this is a few years old as well i've had it for probably two years but i love this like v-neck classic shape and it just looks great over shirts or white t-shirts so styling with the white tee here and the blue jeans and then making it more of like a spring transitional look by adding those sandals and then you could layer as well with the trench coat or the black blazer over your shoulders too so there's lots of ways to kind of layer this for those cooler days but definitely one of those looks that hopefully fingers crossed by the end of like March March will be able to just wear this without any coats and it's going to be warm like I'm literally just like waiting for the warm weather to begin but I really love how they look over white tees and obviously there's loads of different colors of rib vests online to choose from so it's always one of those pieces that you could get like your favorite go-to color that you know is going to work lots of different ways with pieces in your wardrobes I always find that if I'm going to look for a piece like that I have to make sure that it's going to work like at least 15 ways of outfits in my wardrobe and I know for a fact that the ribbed vest is great with like winter outfits for layering with roll necks and shirts and vests and it's great kind of moving into those seasons as well so it's definitely a capsule wardrobe piece that I personally love and wear on repeat and I know having like a black and a cream one in my wardrobe has just been amazing because it's just such a perfect piece moving into spring and then moving back out of summer as well into autumn too. Then next up styling the black blazer and white tee together again and this time styling with my fake leather leggings I've had these for probably around four years now and they're just a piece that I wear on repeat I will at some point probably when we move back into autumn do lots of different ways to style them because I feel like they're the perfect winter piece as well but moving as like a transitional piece into spring they're just really perfect for styling for everyday wear here I've styled them with my high top trainers I'll try and link some similar down below because these Zara ones are sold out but they're great with converse great with like little chunky trainers white trainers black trainers whatever trainers you have they're just a perfect kind of like casual dress down outfit but with like a little bit more tailoring so it makes it that little bit more put together and also works really nicely for again like moving into future like date days or going out with the girls and that kind of thing as well it's just a super classic neutral look that I love wearing and styling you could also style out the trainers and do a wraparound court heel and that takes it straight into evening and then I'd probably add like a red lip as well just to take it into that date night look too but just my classic like again neutral way of styling this and having the fake leather to kind of tie in the black of the blazer and then some black accessories as well then moving on to a more neutral way of styling a white tee and my go-to cream jeans these are from monkey and I just love the shape and style of these I've talked about them I think since last summer now because I did like a 10 ways to wear last summer but they're just that perfect tapered high-waisted fit but that really nice soft denim so they're just super comfortable on I would say I've had these for probably like well two years now or something like that and I feel like I need to get a new pair now because I've worn them so much they're kind of like imprinted into my legs I don't know if you can tell but they're slightly baggy around my knees where I've just worn them probably too much but they're just a gorgeous cream denim and just super comfortable super easy to chuck on and lounge around in as well because they're that soft denim which I just love but I love styling these so many different ways and kind of clashing with lots of different other neutrals I feel like it really ties in those colors so styling here with the white tee with a tan blazer cream jeans and my Veja v10 trainers I've spoken about these trainers before but I am going to mention it again just in case but I have a lot of like Veja trainers they're an amazing brand and the their trainers are just so fab I have a few different like styles I have the campus style and then the v10 style these are the v10 and they're more of that like street style trainer you've got that more detailing with the laces and then the sides I'll kind of leave the 
just like different pictures here so you can see the v10s which i'm gonna leave a picture of here they the tongue of those trainers have taken me probably six months to wear in because they're so tough so i would just say that for reference that they do take a little bit of wearing in i mean me personally i feel like my feet always take a while to get used to shoes but the campus ones are like super soft and didn't take me any time at all to wear in so i will just mention that in terms of trainers but i love both and i think they're fab shoes and again super comfortable once you've worn in the v10s which i'm wearing here and then styling this look and layering with my trench coat just to kind of show how i'd wear it out at the moment because i feel like it's still a little bit chilly some days <laughs> and i need it but styling over with the trench and as you can see like those colors of the tan and the slightly darker kind of beige tan go really nicely together there's always a way of kind of mix and matching those pieces in your wardrobe and i really really like messing around with those kind of neutrals to kind of tie in a look and make it stand out like this so just one of my go-to neutral ways of styling a white tee and then lastly sharing like an all-time fave and classic of mine that i swear i've worn this outfit probably for the last 10 years a lot of my friends watching will be like you wear this outfit a lot and i used to probably wear it on repeat on most nights out and this is just like my classic straight leg charcoal jeans chunky boots and then white tee and my fate leather jacket and like a little crossbody bag to take it to that like everyday wear look as well but fake leather jackets at the moment if you watch my previous video of my styling basics with that I just wear all the time and especially moving into spring and summer I love the fact that being in the UK means you can actually have one of these to chuck on when it gets a little bit cooler on the spring evenings and summer evenings and I feel like they're in their prime in spring because I don't always like layering them too much like I love a massive oversized fake leather jacket in winter with like super layering but I always always find I'm chucking on like a slouch coat over my shoulders and I just love showing them off sometimes so I feel like when we get into like the end of autumn and then also when we get into the end of like winter and then when we get into like the end of summer it's like the perfect time for fake leather jackets to come out and be worn lots of different ways so one of my favorite go-to ways to wear it is styling again very neutrally and using like black and white accessories and pieces and just wearing with the classic white tee styled like this for everyday wear obviously you can change out the shoes to whatever you have in your wardrobe that's more comfortable but just one of my like go-to ways of wearing with a fake leather jacket that I thought I would share as well for like every day too but yeah I hope you guys enjoyed the video and perhaps there are some ways in there that inspire pieces in your own wardrobe to style white tees as well and things like that I've also styled and I will leave some pictures on the screen here of styling a white tee 10 different ways as well moving into spring because I can think of endless ways of wearing it but I didn't want to like bombard this video with like so many different ways of styling because I wanted to keep it basic to those pieces that I know hopefully a lot of you will already have in your wardrobe so you guys can hopefully get like inspiration just from the looks themselves for pieces that you may already have as well at home but let me know if there's anything else you guys want to see and if there's any like ideas for styling basics that you're like please do that then just let me know down below I think I'm going to do white trainers next I feel like they're one of the pieces at the moment that I am I'm just wearing again on repeat so probably white trainers next week and then the week after maybe blue jeans as well so that is coming very very soon but I hope you all enjoyed and I will see you all in the next video lots of love guys Mwah. bye